I've inquired about housing, but there's not that many. Uh, as far as manufactured homes, they're too expensive. And uh, the cheapest one was uh, 475 a month. Mm -hmm. And, so that, as, and what is it, one bedroom? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is it a manufactured home or apartment? Manufactured home. Okay. A whole, a whole bedroom. An RV park? No. Oh. No. The other one that I'm looking at is a, it's a Wilson. Mm -hmm. But a hospital, it's an apartment complex. Mm -hmm. But it's for seniors. Mm -hmm. They're not old enough. Yeah. See? Mm -hmm. And that's a very, it's only 400 bucks a month. Mm -hmm. See? Mm -hmm. But it's, you're not a senior, see? No. And, you, and I, I learned and I kept in the welfare department about the Section 8, and you were right, they are not accepting applications. No, 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 not no more. No more. Mm -mm. So, um, and so you're going to give them a call and tell them of my situation in hopes of a, of a, of a program without me paying rent? No. Because if you tell me pay rent, then it's not worth of wasting your energy because I can't, I don't have the money. I know this. See, we have two programs here. Mm -hmm. One, when we consider people that, like yourself, mm -hmm. where we help you at the beginning mm -hmm. uh, get a place. Mm -hmm. And I wish I knew all of the area where I, like I was in Carson. Mm -hmm. Carson, I could get you into a studio furnished for uh, three a.m. Mm -hmm. and we would. Yeah, but, but the studios are like super small. I mean, and, and I mean that's why I left the city of San Diego. I mean, I used to have a five hundred square feet duplex house. It was bearable, but but it's very very suffocating. Uh, I, in National City, uh, the neighbors was like next door to me. And uh, it was like very hectic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But here. And then when I moved here in Peru, I thought it was like a, like, they said, like they call it a country. And they say no, I did not know the voice travels like far, far away. <laughs> and I used to hear my son playing in the yard. And I'm not kidding you. He used to sound like a CD, a DVD. Uh, that uh, the DVD of uh, sound. Uh, that like a robot or something like it, you know, like it carries the voice. He actually sounded like a DVD sound stereo or something. Yeah. His voice echoed. See, that's the problem here. There's not much available. And what's available, for example, is it's in the country. Mm -hmm. And um, I, I've also had I'm that kind of woman that they do not like to see people are married, have husbands and wives and children and stuff. And I already tried to look for uh, roommates. I, I met this man. He says he has roommates, and I said, do you have a room? He says, no, they're all taken here in Peru. So, so the, but as far as I try to get as a room for rent, there's, no rooms. there's none. No. Or even to call you if, if, if the program's allowed, uh, it's just for a little room with the bathroom as, and whatever, and, and that's it. But it's like, uh, you know, yeah, right. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. no. Mm -mm. See, that's uh, what I'm trying to find out and locate. And then once I try and locate that place, mm -hmm. Uh, then what I do, I present it to the staff here because they have to decide. Your clinician, the one that's treating them, and, and everybody else is okay. Let's help them. Say. But then they say, for how long? Mm -hmm. so it's, not, oh. it's not forever. Oh. Okay, if it would be for how long, um, if you have time for how long, I say.